Hi guys, welcome again to 12 minutes to CLAT. So we are living in one of the most challenging situations our country has ever seen and the COVID-19 graph is actually you know increasing every day and the situation is worsening each and every day. So as a result, the CBSE 12th board exams have been postponed indefinitely and no proper date has been given as to when the exams are going to be conducted because the situation is really unpredictable. We don't know what's going to happen in the next one or two months. If the situation improves, we hope that all these exams are conducted pretty sooner than later. Now, as a result, I feel that the CLAT exam is also going to get postponed like it happened last year because situation as we see this year is much worse as compared to last year, right? So we'll have to see as to when the exam is going to happen. A lot of students feel that the exam can still happen on the scheduled date, which is 13th June 2021 and later whenever the 12th marks are released and whenever the exams happen that can also be attached to it and, and the admission process can be started later. But in my opinion and my experience I feel that this is not going to happen because the situation is not going to improve by 13th June to the extent that all the students there are about 70,000 students who enroll for it now these years. So they cannot go to the examination centers and write the exam safely. So it is the duty and the responsibility of the examination conducting authority to make sure that all the health related precautions and the safety is ensured for the students. Home proctored exam is again not an option as we saw last year the problems created in NLAT 2020 which was ultimately written off. Uh, it was cancelled by the Supreme Court of India. So the only option that we have is an exam on the exam center. It could be an online exam or an offline exam but as we see from the CLAT consortium what they say is that the exam is going to be held online this time and they've said that in the first week of May sometime they're going to come up with a date which I feel is not going to be a tentative, is again going to be a tentative date right because last like last year there were a lot of uh, postponements that happened. So my suggestion is for you guys to keep preparing, keep doing as many mock tests as you can if you are doing online mock tests on your coaching center, I request you guys to take some experience of offline mock test also. You can use this book. This is Oswal books. It has uh, 15 new mock tests as per the new CLAT pattern for CLAT 2021 aspirants. And I have myself looked at all the questions and received feedback from a lot of students because we discussed about this book in one of the previous videos also. And I have received very good feedback so far. Other than that, one issue with this book was the detailed answer sheet was not available with the questions. Now the problem was that the answer key is on the Oswal books website. So I have taken that link and actually you know attached that link in the description box. You can use that link and actually use it for your detailed answer key problems also because it's very important that when you solve an exam or solve a mock test and analyze it, you should have detailed answer key to tell you as to where you went wrong. Okay, why did you uh, not select a particular option which is correct. So it's very important to have the detailed answer key. So you can buy it off Amazon Flipkart or on the Oswal Books website also. I have mentioned all these links in the descri description. You can go and have a look th there as well. Other than that, I feel that a lot of you have been taking online coachings as well. But the problem here is that we are under a lot of stress because again, like last year, a lot of postponements can happen. There are a lot of other things because we do not have a lot of batchmates this time, right? Because we are sitting at home and preparing. So I've been taking one-on-one -on -one personal online sessions for students who are under a lot of stress and do not know where the preparation is going. So we basically map their uh, preparation, what they've been doing so far and try to create a map for future as well, right? So how should they go within the time that is remaining and what should they do about their preparation? That is something we discuss in detail and how to manage that stress level that an aspirant has because I understand that the coaching centers have brilliant subject matter experts who teach their subjects really well. But that is a job half done. Half of the job is something that only an aspirant who has himself or herself cleared this exam can actually make you understand because I was also at your place few years ago. I understand what an aspirant goes through while preparing for this examination. So I've given an email ID in the description box. You can write emails to us and if you're interested in these one hour personal online sessions, we'll be more than happy to respond to it and give you an appropriate slot, preferably on a weekend to interact with you and make you understand as to how you should go with your preparation and how to manage each and everything including your mock tests. All the best guys, keep preparing, do not 
bring that gap that a lot of students brought last year which did not work out really well for them right do not get bored of your preparation be hopeful always stay hydrated stay at home and stay safe all the very best